What is P2P VPS Marketplace and why is it awesome? Well, let's start with the acronym. P2P means peer-to-peer. -peer. A peer-to-peer -peer application allows individuals to share resources over the internet. Some of the more popular pieces of software that use this technology is BitTorrent and Bitcoin. A VPS is a virtual private server. It's an internet connected computer that you get all to yourself and it's capable of serving web pages and web applications. So let's take a look at the VPS marketplace. <clears throat> the, uh, the biggest VPS providers are Amazon, Microsoft, DigitalOcean, Vulture, Linode, and LightSail. The current market cost for uh, a VPS on DigitalOcean using one gigabyte of memory is $10 per month. And this is roughly equivalent to the computing power of a Raspberry Pi. Uh, a Raspberry Pi is a credit card sized mini computer uh, and it costs $35. The Raspberry Pi is what's known as an IOT device. IOT is another acronym that stands for Internet of Things and there's lots of computing devices out there that fall under the acronym of IOT. So the Raspberry Pi here is really just one example. But looking at the costs, it would only take three and a half months to pay back the initial cost of a Raspberry Pi device equivalent to the DigitalOcean $10 a month droplet. So that's a pretty fast payback. Obviously, computing costs could be lower and availability more democratic. More and bigger data centers are not the answer. P2P VPS creates an auction-based marketplace, like eBay, where people can rent out their IoT devices as a VPS and pay through cryptocurrency. This keeps the whole system liquid and decentralized. So the focus on P2P VPS is decentralization. This software will never compete with the big uh, industrial companies in terms of speed or reliability. But <clears throat> one downside of cloud computing with large companies is that they have access to your data, and by extension, so does the government. These organizations can search your data and you'd never know it. They can also censor any information that they want. <clears throat> the legality of decentralization and private hosting of a VPS is very different. There's no one large target to attack. Search and seizure of private property like the Raspberry Pi is much more difficult than requesting it from a company like a big cloud company. Bitcoin and other decentralized currencies are experiencing volatility from speculation. Trading decentralized currency for decentralized computing resources makes sense and it helps to legitimize the cryptocurrency. Here's the point. A decentralized internet is better than a centralized internet. P2P VPS incentivizes people to build a better internet. And if you want to find out more about why decentralization is a good thing, go to p2pvps.org slash decentralize. And the other thing that's awesome about P2P VPS Marketplace is it's 100% open source. The client and server code are up on GitHub and it's published under the MIT license, which is the least restrictive license out there. Run your own marketplace server, and in the future, marketplace servers will share data between each other, creating it, making it impossible to take the marketplace down as it has no central source. Uh, it's also, because transactions will take place using cryptocurrency, the usage and rental of VPSs is semi-anonymous depending on how you obtained your Bitcoin or other cryptocurrency. Find out more about B P2P VPS by going to p2pvps.org or check out our patron page.